I just have to let you know your yeah. Hands on your body, I don't wanna waste no what's in my cheer bag um for this new season i did one last year and this is for my practice um it has changed a little bit since our practices have changed okay so the outside of the bag hasn't really changed at all and we might get new backpacks this year too because it is the start of the season so yeah I just have my hand sanitizer that says cheer with a pom pom on it. Then I have my name tag. If I can, there. I have my name tag and it has my name on it. And then it has a list for competition to put in our bags for competition. Um, just like a suggestion list, like our uniforms, our bows. Um, shoes and all that stuff then I have this little um Jojo Seawolf um bow and pom pom then I have my um uh I guess little ID pass when I went to Vegas and yeah it just has my name and my phone number which I like this little flap right here because it um, kind of keeps everything concealed unless somebody wants to actually unless somebody actually wants to look at this so I like this and then on the front I have a bow that has my initial on it I got this whoa. I got this two years ago um, from Valentine's Day. One of the girls gave it to me. And then I have a little Scentsy dragon. And then I have this Las Vegas monkey hanging on him. And then I have my bows. I have my best back spot, or best back spot ever bow. I mean, my friend have a matching one, and then I have my pink tryout bow, and then I have my green. This is the first bow I've ever got from um, my nuclear cheer, and this was my rec bow because when I did rec and then we would do then we did a performance. I got this, and then next is this side. I don't have that much. I just have a lanyard that I made when I first started cheer in rec um, and then I have this purple watch with little um, bow diamonds on it and if you hit this button it changes colors and sometimes when it will hit my bag um, it will start changing colors which everyone thinks that's really cool and I'm going to start first off in this pocket So I have a big mirror with the like the double sides whatever. And then I have oh god this is open. Um I have little hair ties and a big headband hair tie. I have a secret antiperspirance uh deodorant. It looks like a little EOS. And then I have an EOS. But obviously the EOS is a lot smaller than the antiperspirant. But one of my friends thought this was a jumbo EOS. And um, luckily she didn't put it on her mouth. And then this is my, it's a watermelon EOS. I have this little cardboard. Uh, and we got this with a couple of um, 
hair tie bracelets. Um, so that's garbage. You're gonna find a lot of that in my bag probably. Then I have these oil blotting, blah, oil blotting sheets. There's like 50 sheets. Um, then I have my um, Claire's little thing. It has an S on it for my name. And it has the same thing as the big mirror. Then I have this one. And it is a brush. And this one is actually really good for teasing. I've teased a couple of people's hair with this. And then I have a Mega Volume Plush bunch of words on it. But so basically a mascara. I have a thing of bobby pins, a huge thing of bobby pins because um we have fake hair, but um sometimes I have to tease people's hair because they don't bring their fake hair or they haven't ordered it yet. Um I have this hair tie bracelet which came on this and then it came with the green one and black one I don't know where the other ones are I think they're in my uh, makeup thing and then I have in here there's a little hair hair tie clip and I have three hair ties on it and then I have my two earrings um, pierced through the pocket because I wore these to a competition and I had to take them out for before I competed so yeah and then next is this pocket where the nuclear elite sign is on it and there's actually nothing in this bag and I would put my phone in this bag um, this pocket at practice um, I don't really put stuff in this pocket because I like the nuclear to be flat and not like bulging out. Next is the big pocket. So I have my um, cheer shoes. These ones were just for this year and these ones are last year's and then these ones are my purple and green running shoes um i got these three years ago when i started my first year cheer and uh for tire week i went and bought these because i need more running shoes and then i found those and they were like perfect then I have band-aids because my team is like an accident prone team, I swear. Um, my team always gets hurt, um, especially the girls on my team. Then I have a lint roller. Um, since we um, last year we had a black uniform, so this came in handy. We had one black uniform, our other one was white. And then I have these no slip grip uh hair ties these actually rip out my hair but they work good for like braids and stuff like that and then i have lotion and that's in the pocket on the side and then i have a zip tie end because for our hair we zip tied it in uh, then I have the other zip, another zip tie end, and then a bunch of little hair ties that are just scattered on the bottom. Next is this big lip, and this is a huge bag. This is the Rebel Elite bag, and I really like this bag. So on that top, I have a, um, these are boxing wraps but actually these work because I used to do boxing but actually these work awesome for like rolled ankles or whatever um if somebody's already using my ankle brace or I am but I usually have two in here one's in the wash right now because I used it because I hurt my ankle doing a round off back tuck 
Um, so yeah, I have one of these and then usually my wrist brace is in there, but I'm using it right now. So this works good for mostly anything. Um, I can use it on knees, I could use it on anything. Um, and I've had a, uh, I think last year around the end of the season, I had to use a lot of my ankle braces and wrist braces and stuff like that. For people that have got hurt, obviously my team's an accident prone team. What can you do? Um, then, obviously being my team accident prone, I have after my in case they get stung or whatever, or I get stung because um, my body doesn't react well to um, bee stings. I don't get like really sick. I'm not like allergic allergic, but my skin will start to peel and stuff like that. And then I have this. It works for sunburns, cuts, bee stings, mosquito bites. Also, I've used this on a sunburn and a cut, and it works really good. And then I have this pocket here. And there's nothing in it. You can put, like, a laptop or whatever. I usually put, like, paperwork in here if I have a meeting before cheer or after cheer. And then I have this pocket, which is for shoes. And I do not use that pocket. Um... I used to, but it just made my back really, really big and it wouldn't sit upright. So I don't really use that. And I don't really use my big space, anyways. So, yeah. And then I have this little water bottle pocket um, that I usually put my water bottle in. And yeah, that's basically all of the. That's all my stuff in my bag um i actually had less garbage than i thought i would because i did clean it out a little bit ago i will do hopefully i will do a what's in my competition cheer bag it just depends because i had um i had one in my mind for last year and i didn't do it because i was so busy so yeah Tell me, what, tell me what you guys want in the comments, um, because I'm going to be just posting random stuff until competition season, um, gets started. Um, and, yeah, I might be doing a little bit of filming my practices and kind of, like, getting ready for practices. Um, but, yeah. I will see you guys next time. Like and subscribe this like and subscribe um for more videos i guess sort of like this but if you want to see my face again and if you like what i have to say then please subscribe and yeah see you guys later bye